morning guys so i kind of just woke up like an hour ago i slacking a bit okay just replying emails and everything so you can see i'm like no makeup today ah uh, no makeup yet i kind of just i just threw on like an old dress or something because i forget i'm just gonna go down for just a quick breakfast i only have like 20 minutes actually because the breakfast is at uh there's a complimentary if i'm not wrong it's complimentary breakfast every day at kampong kitchen from 6 30 a.m to uh 10 30 a.m from weekdays, from every day, like basically. So yeah, I only have like 20 minutes. Hope the food is worth waking up for because I'm like, oh, could I just go back to sleep? Because it's like a Sunday, right? Okay, let's go see what they have. I'm back at Kampong Kitchen for breakfast. It's pretty crowded. So there's less stuff, but more breakfast food. And lots of fruits. Okay, oh, here's what I'm having and cereal. Sadly, I was a bit slow, so I didn't get to eat my fruits, damn it. But if I just want to say something, is that please go have. Okay, usually buffet breakfasts are just, you know, like, eh, it's okay. This is not too bad. Uh, the things were average, I guess, but. I have to just give a shout out to the Danish pastries, especially the croissants, the mini ones. Oh my god, they were really good. They were really these tiny little croissants. Super good. Crispy, fresh, especially when you get them out of the oven. That was the best one ever. So if you come here for the breakfast, go for the Danish pastries. I think they are also available at the Petite Paris, um, the little cafe downstairs. So I'm going to be getting a box of them. So I hope they will taste as good as I remember. Mm, but can't wait. Okay, so back in my room now. Let me see. Probably just go figure out what I'm going to do. Probably work or something. Alright, thanks for watching. Hey guys, so this is like my last day and probably like the last five minutes of my room and <laughs> kind of sad to be leaving but you know what all good things must come to an end right so yeah um just one last look in my room before i check out usually i just make sure that everything's nicely all in place you know so my really really comfy bed for the last few nights and then soft out my work dress and everything I'm just really gonna miss the view the most though because it's really 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 nice and um, yeah just everywhere in a hotel wherever you go you go to the gym you go to the kampong kitchen you go anywhere you get a really really good view yeah but of course I'm gonna miss the bed because the bed is super comfortable I couldn't bear to leave it yeah this is literally the best vacation ever in Kuala Lumpur I think not too bad I would reconsider staying here as well when I'm back here in the future Okay, and my luggage is all packed. You know what's my biggest worry though? My biggest worry is that um, because Air Asia has only seven kg of luggage, and if and one carry on. So if you check, you know, you look at my bags, it's definitely not seven kg. It's probably ten. So I'm a bit worried. I'm. Yeah, but fingers crossed that they won't really charge me. I've checked online. It's about 112 ringgit or something. So. I really really hope that they get I get past immigration. I don't have to pay the fees. Oh my god, that's the bad the downside about um budget airlines and everything. So yeah, always make sure you know the luggage. Um what's the maximum amount of luggage you can bring on board and also um check how much is the excess fee if needed. If you're a heavy packer like me, because I'm a kind of person who actually overpacks, I pack every single thing so yeah mm, then maybe you want when you might want to like just top up for um luggage and everything so yeah okay kind of sad but it's time to go so see you in a bit last but not least thank you so much avis kuala lumpur city center for having me for the last three days two nights thank you so much all right and ootd for today Heading up to the airport, see ya! Last look. Come on, let's go. Just reached 
the airport, heading over to check in, and I'm super full right now. I had, I ate everything, on, <laughs> including the drinks. So that's gonna be my last indulgence for this entire trip. Back to my fitness routine and back to trying to lose weight because I really gained really freaking a lot of weight. To recommend you a souvenir, I would always recommend getting a Sumbao bag. Okay, it's just to share that Asia is really very strict about the luggage, so it really has to be 7 kg and below. So just FYI, my face when I finally make it true. <laughs> Yeah, Malaysia. I love my trip. Souvenir.